the place online for derby specific training advice. Today's workout is a 250 rep routine and it's focused entirely on core strength. Having a really strong core is essential to roller derby. It allows you to juke and deke like crazy and also can help you become the hardest hitter on the track. Plus, working on your abs has some side benefits like maybe giving you a nice six pack. The best part about the workout today is that there is not a single crunch in it. And this is my number one tip for you for doing ab workouts, is that doing crunches will not give you a six pack. To get a six pack, you really have to work on your oblique muscles. Those are the muscles down either side of your torso. It's way more functional for roller derby to do that because we don't move straight forwards and backwards. We're all about lateral movement. So improving your oblique strength will help you on the track. Here's how the workout is gonna go. We've got five core strengthening exercises and in between each one, we're gonna do 30 high knees. Count both knees up as one rep. Altogether, the whole thing will add up to 250 reps. The high knees are also a great core strengthening exercise. So just make sure that you're engaging your lower abs to lift those knees up. And don't let me catch you doing low knees. These are high knees, so I wanna see your knees up above 90 degrees. This workout is not time-based uh, because form is the most important part. So give yourself as much time as you need, take some rest if you need to, in order to make sure that you're maintaining good form for the whole workout. So let's get warmed up and let's do this. As usual, um, I hope you like it. If you do, then please like it and share it with your friends. Uh, I'd love it if you can visit me over at rollerderbyathletics.com and leave me a note in the comments and tell me how you thought this video went for you. I just finished kicking your ass, so you can go kick somebody else's. See ya.